Still an empty net out at the other end. The extra man, Gavin Thorison. Awaiting puck drop. Comes down, one back by the Blackhawks. Matika plays it across for Robertson. Shot there, redirected just wide. Matika going after it. Taken up against the boards by Romer. Cheslock unable to hold the possession. Down for Thorison. Kusler coming in, disrupt play. Kicked on net. Arrival trying to get a glove on it. Taken away. Caden Brown out to Robertson. Moves it one timer by Matika. Save made loose. And I'm not sure how Harabo was able to catch that rebound, but he did it. 328 left to play in the third. More pushing and shoving after the play. And Shivsky and Kusler are going to pick up penalties there. Those will be two roughing calls. So you're taking off one of the top players of the Waterloo Blackhawks. They're going to rule four on four hockey. So the ice will be a little bit more wide open for this Waterloo squad as they have a lot of control in their attacking end. So with the empty net, we'll have five on four hockey, but it is even strength as both teams have a man in the box. Once again, Garrett Shivsky and Ryan Kusler both picking up roughing minors there after the whistle. One back by the Blackhawks. Robertson just able to hold the blue line. Matika. Matika down below the goal line. Thorson's pass out, finds O'Connell. O'Connell on the near side. Walks in down towards the goal line. Banks it out for Robertson. Robertson down for O'Connell. Finds Thorson, backhanded out front. Matika not in position to bang that one home. Matika back out to Robertson. Moves it for O'Connell. Coming in back to Thorson, can't catch it cleanly. Thorson still with the possession, held up by Picozzi. Launched around for O'Connell. 2.50 left in the third, minute 22 left in the four on four play. Still an empty net at the other end. O'Connell rips one there, knocked down loose out front, another save, another opportunity knocked away. Robertson feeds it down for Matika. Sends it through traffic, caught there, can't get the shot off, save made on the second opportunity, and Harabo gets the glove on that one. And Michael Harabo continues to play out of his mind in this one. 34 shots faced, 34 saves. As the Lancers still in penalty kill mode here. Still a minute 04 in the Shivsky and Kusler penalty. Still an empty net at the other end. Lancers just unable to get the opportunity to go for the 200 footer. Cardona with it in the corner. He'll flick that one away. Piant can't hold his own. Tipped off his leg. That one could do it. Will it find the back of that? Goes just wide. And Adam Cardona once it ruled that Pionk tipped it. Alexi Kivioya yelling about the same thing. And we're going to have an officials meeting here. Lancers are saying it tipped off the skate of Joe Pionk at the red line. Two twenty-one left to play in the third. Waterloo gifted another attacking zone face-off here. Tie up off the draw. One back by the Blackhawks, but sent away. And Cardona nets it. So the Blackhawks originally won back the face-off. Cardona cut off the play and sent it from his own blue line. And that'll be Cardona's fourth of the season. Larrigan breaking in. Larrigan drops it for Buckberger, pass down low, can't find Wyatt Olsen. Picozzi sends it for Salici. He'll find Nemix, leaving it now for Stupka, rushing in with Fernandez. Out front shot, they're loose, and he scores! Libor Nemix bangs home the rebound off the original shot from Justin Stupka, and the Lancers have their first lead of the weekend. And that'll be Libor Nemix, fifth of the season, moving up to six points on the year as he has an assist to accompany that. It was Stupko who started the play, came in, got stopped by Cameron Whitehead, but Whitehead overslid on the play, and Libor Nemix came in right there, and all he had to do was tap that one in. Rear end, gives it up to Fleming. 
into the attacking end. Ring, far side boards, big bounce off the kick, fight, bump with it now. He's got a chance, shorthanded. Into the attacking end, no look pass, down to Montgomery. Shot there and he scores! Drew Montgomery from Alex Bump. 1-15 into the second period of play. They net the shorthander and the Lancers pull within one. What a play that was. Picking the puck up in the neutral zone, carrying that one into the attacking end. Managed to get the no-look pass. New Montgomery was near the high slot and found him perfectly and blows it right past the blocker of Xavier Medina. Jonah to Smith at center. Shot through traffic, redirected into save me. Now to Jarecki. Plays it for Salici, back out. Smith creeping in, now to Cardona on the outside. Near side boards, leaving it there for Rowe. He'll walk towards the high slot. Back down low to Cardona. He'll rip one and he scores! Adam Cardona even sinks up on the power play. 15-33 left to play here in the third. So the Lancers who have been in control for the majority of this game just could not find the back of the net. As they near the 30 shot mark of the night, Adam Cardona picks the short side corner and beats Elias up high. What a beauty of a shot there by Adam Cardona. Answer. One back by the Lancers. Montgomery with it. 535 left in the first. Still scoreless in this one. Montgomery rushing ahead. Now along the Romer. Romer halts just inside the attacking end. Now down for Pierre. Down low to Fernandez. Back door. And he scores. Justin Skupka on the one-timer. Tic-tac-toe passing. And the Lancers take the one nothing lead on the power play. So the Lancers, one for one on the main advantage tonight. Matt Romer entered the attacking zone, building the play, found Pierre down in Nemec's back door for Stupka, and netted the one-timer past the blocker at Jackson Irving. Looking ahead, batted up there to Cruz. He'll take the body of Joyce. Stupka in down low, slams on the brakes, tried to pass off front for Kivioya. Another opportunity, and he scores! Alexi Kivioya from Justin Stupka pulls the Lancers back within one. 12.46 left to play here in the second. And it didn't look like Stupka's pass was going to make it all the way in. But Kivioya got the initial shot, picked up his own rebound, and backhanded that one right past the blocker hand of Jack Stark. Shots on goal in this one, 22 to 10 Chicago. We got ourselves a one goal game. As that one's going to be good for Alexi Kivioya, seventh of the season. And hand Justin Stupka his sixth assist of the year. Face off to the left side of Kuckendorfer. 3.48 left in the overtime period. Shots on goal totals 32 to 30 in favor of Sioux City. Bump to Shed, moving in, shot there, and he scores! Tucker Shed wins it in overtime here for Omaha. And the defending champs go down and are still winless on the regular season. The goal from Tucker Shed, the primary to Alex Bump, and the secondary to Andon Serbone wins it 2-1 here for Omaha. Just a minute 35 into the overtime period. They left him wide open there in the high slot, and it cost them. Once again, Tucker Shed pulling through with his first of the regular season. Tries to pass across, tipped up in the air. Stupka bats that one away. Wall back with it now, heading into the attacking zone. He's got Lurie, moves it back for him, shot there, and he scores! Charlie Lurie give him a multi-point night as the Lancers come back with four unanswered. 19 seconds into the second period of play. The Lancers now have the one goal lead. So Reese Lawback now up to three points on the night, a goal and two assists for him. It looked like it was almost too late to find that pass back for Lurie, but he connected on it. And Charlie Lurie beats Axel Mango, and that'll trigger a net minor change. Croy Kalkendorfer coming in now. So.
Loose off the draw, picked up by Pierre. That shot whistles just high. Loose out front now, swinging away at it. Lowback trying to backhand that one, knocked down low. Jarecki trying to make it off the netminder. Still loose out in the goal crease, and that one spits out for Smith. He'll rip one, and he scores! Will Smith, his first of the season, pulls the Lancers up 2 0. 18 14 left to play here in the third. And just a hectic play off the draw. Shots missing wide left and right. Knocked below the goal line. Lowback moved it back out front. Still swinging away at it. Finally pokes loose where it finds Will Smith out towards the high slot. He rips one through traffic and beats Spicer Glove side. Not a Baker. Backhanded up. Pierre spits it loose for Montgomery. Montgomery into the attacking end. Not a Pierre. Back down low for Montgomery. Shot there and he scores. Season. 